Hi there, Aaron Decker, your internet marketing football coach, and today I want to jump right into this video and make it short, as short as possible. Can you retire in network marketing? So many people talk about, you know, quitting your job and firing your boss and, you know, riding off into the sunset, but, you know, some companies, uh, if you really read the fine print and the policies and procedures, they don't like it when you walk away and, you know, travel the world twice a year or six six months at a time and you know you may be you may want to look at your policies and procedures and really see if you can retire um, because if you look around you really don't see many people that are retired from network marketing they may say they're retired but they're still bringing in people into the company because they might have to and you know those are just some that was just one little thing that I learned when I, I went through uh, an ebook called Success in 10 Steps. And, you know, you can go to the link below and, and get that ebook for yourself because, I mean, it, it's just going to help you so, so much in network marketing. And that is just one topic that, you know, the book really hits on. There's so many others that you need to know about, about network marketing because this is a great industry. And yes, you can retire from network marketing, just not with all the companies. Um, and, you know, it, it's sad, but there's a lot of um, bad stuff in, in some of the company's policies and procedures, and you want to find a company that has a good policies and procedures that are going to be favorable to both the company and you as a, a rep and a distributor in the, in the field. Um, you know, because, yes, companies do have to protect themselves, but, you know, some of them, they, they go over overboard and, you know, they pretty much can't, they don't let you do anything. You, you know, some of them, and, you know, you may say polishes procedures. Well, what the heck are, I've never even seen them. Well, a lot of companies, you just check the box saying, I read the terms and conditions, and that included the policies and procedures. So you may want to go check out your policies and procedures, and, and if you need help finding them, because I know for one of my previous companies, I had a heck of a time trying to find them. And, and when I did, I found out they were about 50-plus pages long. And, you know, my present my present company, it's it's about three pages long, and it took me about four minutes to read it. So just a little thing. Can you retire network marketing? Yes, yes, you can retire network marketing. Network marketing is the greatest industry out there in the world to be part of. Now, I know I'm kind of biased because I'm in network marketing, but in what other industry can you, you know, leverage the, the efforts off of other people? Uh, there really isn't hardly any other. And, you know, the income that... The, income potential that you can make from network marketing. So can you retire network marketing? Absolutely. Yes, you can. Um, you know, so that's just a little tip. And, uh, you know, my name, again, is Aaron Decker, your Internet Marketing Football Coach. And please feel free to share this video with friends, relatives, fellow networkers. And also, if you have any questions or comments, leave those below. Or uh, I'll put my contact info here and you can give me a call or shoot me an email or get a hold of me on Skype. All right. Have a great day.